Hello everybody and welcome back to an episode of the Banny of Isaac new save file. We're jumping in again. This time we're going to go as the deleted. We gotta love some deleted. Deleted is a hell of a lot of fun and we're going to be playing a good amount of him over the coming episodes because he's just, yeah, he's a lot of fun. Uh, we're not going to play Herodicium. We're going to play Happy 99 to start with because Happy 99 is just the basic guy. And like I said, we're going to try and use this as an opportunity to fill our donation machine and stuff like that because I think we're getting to that point where we need to start trying to actually fill it. I'll also open that up as well. Why not? Oh, you got to be kidding me with that goddamn curse. Every time. Um, yeah, I'll take that as a, as a regular item. That seems kind of interesting. I'm very annoyed that literally every single one of those rocks came back. Yeah. We can use the poop for zero. Huzzah. <laughs> what value? What great value. Yeah, I'm very annoyed at that. That was an absolute, absolute waste of a bomb that I was not expecting to have wasted. Yeah, this pull root thing seems pretty good, to be honest. Quite a lot of extra damage. And the, the fact that they, they stay with you through rooms is it's kind of amazing. Like, we're going to absolutely destroy this boss with these guys, right? And they've all got different tier effects attached to them as well. Yeah, this is cool. I like this. Oh god, I didn't expect that. We're setting him on fire. He's electrocized. Oh my god. That was pretty cool. Uh, this is definitely one we're going to bit flip the... Upon next floor, we get that. Spawn 26 bombs, extra damage. Um, first hit each room, 18% chance to spawn an exorcist. I'll take that. Good old 18 bombs. We'll go find the secret room, I think. I think it's only prudent with the amount we've got here. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Might even be able to take a look at the shop if we get a good secret room going. There's that one. Darren Tootin. We also got a soul heart as well, which I'm pretty happy about. As for the question of the day today, um... What's something unexpected that's happened to you recently? I feel like that could be a good one. Trying to path my way through here. It's taken a while. I'm, I was hoping I'd get like petrified poop along the way, but sadly, didn't even get a penny. I just got the penny at the end and that was it. That was largely quite disappointing. Although it was immensely satisfying to just chisel through all those turds. Which isn't a sentence I thought I'd be saying today, but hey her. I thought I'd be saying it tomorrow when I'm actually going chiseling for turds, but not today. Right, got some more pull roots. Really, I shouldn't use these um, until I'm ready, to be honest. I don't know what the deal is with the bees. Sometimes bees come and like, oh, is it because they're like plants and the bees are coming to pollinate? Like, right, can I blow this up now and actually get it? I'm going to be a dick, are you? I mean, you kind of been a dick by giving me three fucking spiked rocks. It's not. Yeah, you bitch. <laughs> That's horrible of you. Um, I'm not really understanding where the hell seek room is, to be honest. I'm guessing it's here. No. Um, it has to be of this side then, right? It has to be. No. What the hell? Where is it? So it's not here. It can't be to the left of here. It can't be to the right of here. It can't be up from here. It... it ca Technically, it can't be down from here, but at this point, I've got to try it. It can't be there. It can't be there. This is really confusing. I know I'm wasting bombs here, but I'm just trying to figure out what the hell's going on. Can't be there. Can't be either of those. Definitely buy that. Not very nice of you, game. 
Seems the pole roots have stuck around for a while, actually. I, I'm going to try all of these, just in case. Yeah, that, that makes literally no sense. <laughs> Excuse me, game, but that is... Not how this is meant to work at all. Dude, this fucking bombing thing is so fucking annoying. Oh my god! Why have they got such a high chance to replace themselves? It should be so much lower than that. <laughs> Wasted so many bombs, god damn it. Yeah, I, I'm fine with it a bit, but like, come on. Um... Go with that, why not? Some interesting stuff going on, right. Let's get ourselves out of this floor that we've spent five whole minutes on. God damn. Yeah, that was secret room. Why you do this sometimes? Why you gotta be so confusing? I don't know how you're meant to work at all. Okay. So we started with um, bloody gust and defibs on this floor. Don't know how long my pull root boys will last in here, but we'll use them where we can. Glad that we've uh, took that as a regular item, though, because it seems pretty darn strong, to be honest. Three to five every time we use it, only a three room charge. It's a lot of extra, like, damage and tier effects. Why does my character look so withered? Why is he so blue? Is that the defibs maybe doing that? I don't know. Oh, there's an invisible guy up here. I didn't see you. Cheeky bastard. Oh, just about got it. Just about got it. In here, we're definitely going to be changing that. Um, each planetarium. Great. Just, you know, each planetarium. Um, first hit each room, spawn a blind creep. Um, why not? you guys at that. I love the way they move, the way they like roll around. It's kind of cute. It's kind of cute. Haha! -ha. Taste my root, b-boy. Stuff. I don't know. Did a rock destroy that? Oh shit, there was a spider. Okay, so that's a blind creep. It's only the first hit each room where that happens, though. It's kind of an annoying room. The way that these guys move is not conducive to having a lot of them at once. Don't like it. Our health is not looking so healthy right now. So we've, not had anything, we've not had anything like super wacky yet, but we, we've got some interesting stuff going on. Need some more HP, definitely. Oh, dude. Take more damage, why don't you? This, this might be a quick restart here, because... Uh, your boy Turtle Melon has literally no idea how to play the game. He's literally played every single day for over two years. Just can't do it, boy. Just can't play this game right. I don't know what the pink one does. What does the pink one do? Charm. Why would I not know that? <laughs> Why would I not just guess that it'd be charm? Um, that's not that good, but I'll take it. Why not? This is what I was looking for, baby. Nine lives. Bugger off shooting me. Away we go. We got ourselves nine lives. Helps out. But every time we enter an arcade, we're going to lose three pennies, though. Okay, this is annoying. Ah, oh, the web. Do you know what's more annoying? The fucking webs. Get the webs out the goddamn way.
Take out these guys. Oh, I can, like, devolve those with one of these dudes. Nice. The white one devolves enemies. I like that. Yeah, look at that. You are no longer you, good sir. Okay. Easy stuff. We've got the um, flying through doors thing if we want to skip a room. Do you know what? Skip this room for now. We get 4.5 damage in this room for some reason. We come back in here and we can use our roots to make this room a bit easier. Pull roots make life a lot easier for us. But why not take advantage? Aha, charmed, buddy. Charmed and then stunned. Once he's stunned, him being charmed is kind of useless. But <laughs> hey-ho, it's fine. Yeah, these pull root dudes are uh, pretty, pretty stonking good. They seem to die fairly quickly, but by the time they're all dead, we, we tend to get the next batch. Don't like the idea of this room. I get what you're meant to do, and I don't like it. Okay. Works out pretty much fine. Blowing up a beggar has a chance to spawn a different random beggar in its place. That's kind of good. Good. See you trying to slap me, boy. I won't have it. Got fear on that dude. Nice. We're going to have to do the tr whole trinket swap here. Very annoying. Right. I don't know why I'm getting 4.5 damage in some rooms. Is that my defibs doing that, maybe? I think that's my defibs. Oh, wait. I've got two sets of defibs now. Do you wonder if they're stacking? I think they're stacking, you know. I think every second room I'm getting 1.5 times damage twice. That, that could get pretty crazy later on. Ah, oh, bad hit. We got one of those exorcist boys as well, spawning shit. My god, dude. Just Oh, those fucking... Those ghosty boys are not friendly. For some reason, I thought they were. Oh, dude. Just get lost. Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's more like it. What the hell are you doing in the corner over here? What's, what's this? What's this about? I've never seen you nestled into the corner like this before. I'm confused. This guy shouldn't be too bad. We're doing an alright job of him. There we go. Um, Mum's suppository is pretty decent, I think. I'm gonna flip it anyways. Remove. Extra HP, why not? Right, down we go. Right, so we're gonna get another defib now. We are gonna get another defib, okay. Yes, they are, they are very much stacking. So every second room, we basically have insane damage for the rest of the run. But every normal room, we don't. So we're at 12.5. In this room, we're at 3.6. Yeah, that's going to be that's gonna be kind of confusing and difficult to follow, but also pretty cool. It's a nice interaction. My rooty boys, excuse me. I don't think you can step to me, boy. Also, this root guy is stuck in the doorway. Oh, there's still a fly going around me? Get off me. Kidney stone, I'm just going to take. Kidney stone's very good. Kidney stone's just like an insta-kill machine gun for most rooms. Even with low damage. Nice. And then the other room we have a ton of damage. 12.5, baby. 
I wanted six suppository to maybe boost the damage it gave us, but I was thinking, what if I have lower base damage and so it gives me less? Then I'll be ultra sad. There you go, baby. It seems like all the hard rooms are the rooms we end up having 3.6 damage and all the easy rooms, it's like, there's the, there's the large damage. We've got to try and engineer it so that we have this damage for the boss. Which I don't know if... I don't know how plausible that is. I really don't like these enemies. And therefore I bomb them. Oh, you bastard. It's this bloody thing. I don't like those either. Get out of here. Right, so we want to go in here to get the low damage. And then... Oh, I don't think it's going to work. I think we're always going to have low damage in here. Sad times. At least we get the pull roots or some of them at least. Yeah, not too bad at all. Um, there's no chance I'm taking that. I'm sorry. Uh, two old chests. Terrible as well. I'll take that. Right, next floor. So now I should be getting an even more insane damage bonus every second room. Yeah, now I'll get 18 damage every second room. The fact that it's like multiplicative like this is hilarious. And the fact that like we're still on base damage. This is kind of wacky. Every second room we become a god. Okay, okay. Get one of these bad boys, why not? Do I think Yara does much for us? And maybe it doubles room drop? Nah. Now, now I just need some real damage ups, because that'll make my th every third room even stronger and my regular room still okay. Okay, can we stop? Let's just not get hit a thousand times. I think it's just because I'm so not used to having the low damage now. Really, I should have gone back to get those red hearts before I... Oh, wow. Oh, wowee. <laughs> that was such a bad death. Yeah, let's go and... Okay, we can't even get the health. Never, never you mind that. Oh, dude, that guy is insane. He does full heart damage as well. Fuck you. Full heart damage, bitch boy. Right, fuck you, die. <laughs> you gave me a small rock, so I'll accept that. We did get a planetarium here, which does affect one of our items, I think. Neptunus is really good. Yeah, we got this 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 toothpaste thingy. Neptunus, I'm just gonna take. You I'll play the hell out of, I think. Yeah, you kind of take too long, though. And you could give me Mars. I'll, I'll leave it there. That is pretty beautiful. Good stuff. Now, that's a good active, but... No. Um. Why not? We now spawn a go on using our thingy, but holy shit! I've got like triple shot or something for. I had a triple shot or something for a second there. I'm like, and I freeze. He's really is the one enemy left over here. Why you gotta be like that? It summons Siren something or other when I do this. Okay. Didn't seem to do anything, to be honest. The game has lied to me. Okay. Pop in here. Ah, oh, you again. 
Luckily, we have the high damage going on. Hmm. I just gained a lot of HP, and I'm not quite sure why. Hmm. <laughs> that pumpkin mask probably doesn't do anything that I want it to do, does it? Hmm. I don't know what the pumpkin mask does, but I vaguely remember it being, like, it gives you full health, but now I take damage over time or something. That vaguely rings a bell. But we've gotten a lot more powerful. And our damage is, is pretty ludicrous now. Cool. Pull roots, you are coming with me. Up to 6.55 damage as of base. And we're, we get 26 in every other room, so... Pretty funky. Pretty funky. And then, yeah, we have just an insane amount of pull roots here. Obviously, we're not going to keep our freezing tears forever, but I'm going to cherish them while we have them. That I'm just straight up taking. I'm sorry. Like, that is so absurdly overpowered. No way I can't take that. Yeah, so there you go. I just took damage over time there, so I, I was right. The curious thing I have is, does using multiple of them have any effect? Because we, we use one after killing every boss, which could be really bad for us, because it could speed up the process at which we self-damage. I don't know. Could be real bad. Or it could make no difference whatsoever. Okay, we're all out of thingy now. Keep those pull roots coming. Now that they're able to speed through rooms, we can just build up an absolute army of them. It's kind of great. Ow. My bad. <gasps> yes, please. Boom. Boom. Oh my god, the amount of tears. This is why Kidney Stone is amazing. It can sometimes be a bit tricky, but most of the time it's good stuff. Who cares? Minus 10 luck and we're already at minus 0.5. Makes no difference to me, buddy. Makes no difference to me. It's good as well that the, the fire rate from Kidney Stone carries through rooms as well. Kind of have, like having sort of a Soul of Azazel type thing. Emperor card's very good for the womb. Cool. Get this going before we get into our boss. Oh my god, yes. It did give us full health when we used that. Oh my god. I did not like that. Uh, I guess we'll go Dark Path here. Empty Vessel seems good for the flight here. Um, have a look-see. Spawn nine coins after three hits. Yeah, we'll take that. Nah, we won't take that. We'll already got girth every time. Right, how, how high is our damage going to be now? <laughs> every second room. Pennies. 50. Oh wait, we got an Emperor card. What am I doing? Twenty every, every twenty seconds, six six turns to spawn five golden troll bombs. Isn't that the one that makes enemies explode? Yeah, let's take it. Why not? Seems fun. Seems like a lot of fun to me. Yeah, got this item where we can like walk through doors, so we can just kind of like zoom on through, trying to find the boss room. We've got flight as well here, which makes this even easier. There you go. 
Nice and easy. Oh, and we get the, the big damage boost, which is now up to 86 damage. Lovely. Excuse me. Not only did I not get two chests, I got a chest that I can't even fucking open. 30% chance to fire confusion tier. After completing a boss fight, all runes are converted. Uh, we'll definitely do backstabber because backstabber is amazing. We'll bit flip this to see what we get. Nah, we won't do that. Um. Hmm. I'm no longer able to unbit flip, and I'm not quite sure why. Might not do hush. Yeah, I'm un I'm unable to unbit flip, and I'm I'm curious as to why that is. It just spawns one of those dudes. Oh, bollocks. I don't have any keys left. Ow. Can you chill out for a minute, game? <laughs> Why are you lagging so hard? I can't unbit flip. Um... Both of those are crap for us. Don't like these golden troll bombs. On grab bag, uh, seems good enough. Let's go. Oh wait, I can unflip flip now. It's fixed. I don't know what I did to fix it. Okay, I should stop taking so much damage. Now this is this kind of works for me. Okay, I'm back to full health, so it doesn't matter. Oh, dude, I just realized I got unlucky with my uh, thingy here. I've not gained, um... Dude, these golden troll bombs need to get on top of him, like, right now. It's gonna make our life a lot easier if they stay next to him. <laughs> it's pretty funny, to be honest. <laughs> it's just like a mess. Like, I don't need to fucking do anything here. It's just a group of fucking rogue golden troll bombs that have an absolute vendetta against this boss. <laughs> that was hilarious. They just all were like, okay, we understand the assignment. It's go time. There's so many of them in here. Right, what am I doing? Going dark path, I think? Yes, that's what I'm doing. Dark path. Go. <laughs> that's pretty funny. Okay, we are up to 564 damage now. Every second room. It's quite a bit of damage every second room. We go from 24 to 600. 24 is pretty good. 600 is a bit better. Don't worry about that. Every time we kill a boss, we get max HP anyways. We're basically unkillable, so... I don't really care that much about taking damage. I do not like, however, the fireworks that happen every time we get hit, because the game starts to shit itself. The game really doesn't like it. Also, we went all the dead ends. 
Why am I up to a thousand damage now? Where am I getting all this damage from? This old bell thing keeps giving me more and more damage, I think. Where, where am I getting all of these from? I'm up to 49 base damage. What, what happened? I think every time I go through a room, I get a new one of these. Oh my lord. This might be the most damage I've ever had. These runs get nutty. 1,700. And we get to use it on the boss as well. Perfect. Boom. Boom. We're at 1,800 damage there. Last floor, where we sit in. Spawn 70 batteries. Very nice. Um... We'll do that. 3,000 damage. Just 3,000. I can't even see where the fuck I'm going. We got 81 damage now. 3,200. Nice. Those enemies just kind of died. Not really sure why. 3,400. Is this boss... I guess this boss invincible? What's going on here? Even with only 93 damage, this is pretty crazy. And we have much more than 93 most of the time. 3,590. Every room, it, the damage goes up by about 200. <laughs> Apparently we never finished this room. This pumpkin thing's going wild. Yeah, the fireworks are, are really, really annoying. They just, like, completely destroy the game's frame rate. Okay, we actually have mapping now. We know where we're going. That helps. What doesn't help right now is Kidney Stone. Having Kidney Stone with this setup is not ideal. I don't really care about being hit here. It's fine. Oh my god, 4,200 damage. And we're going to have it for the boss as well. Beautiful. Four thousand five hundred damage for the boss. Beautiful stuff. Beautiful stuff. I could victory lap here. could do my victory laps. Why not? Why not? We're early on. We're early doors. Don't like the fact that um, I don't have mapping. But I am interested in, in seeing how just how high our damage could get. I'm probably not going to take any other items just to try and not completely ruin what we already have. Yeah, very upset to not have mapping right now. Make our life a lot easier. 
I would like some speed up, though. My speed is pretty atrocious right now, and it's a bit of a bummer. Right. Good old dead you. Okay. We do have 13,000 damage now. Tears have transcended size. Hey, this is what I want the thingy card, the mapping for, because we've got the sun card always. Means we can just skibbity scot through. Beautiful stuff. Intriguing. I will take this, why not? I do have two broken hearts now, which I'm sure can gather themselves up pretty quick. Um, I don't think I want any of those. Keep it going. Now, I'm going to say, I guess the broken hearts could technically add up quick. Right, straight to the boss. I don't care about you. I'm just going to leave. <laughs> 258,000. Like, I have so much damage in these rooms that I can't fucking hit anything. it's all dead. Right, down we go. Just need more speed and I can really get through this quick. Oh, I have 1.9 speed right now. That's nice. Wasn't expecting that, but I'll take it. My guy. Okay. Cool. Yeah, this is the way to do it. This is the way to do it. Perfection there if we want it, I guess. Why not? <laughs> no, it doesn't really help, does it? I'm looking for speed ups in here, really. If I can find speed ups in there, then I'll be happy, but otherwise I'm not taking anything. Hey, getting mapping straight away is very, very nice. Oh, a few look ups. Offset our luck a little bit. <clears throat> are we up to 700,000 now? I think we are. Wait, is that 7,000? No, that's definitely... That's 76,000, sorry. Or 700,000. Don't want to be ridiculous. Gotta get it right. Like, my damage is so high that I can't fucking hit anything. Also, by the way, if you have epilepsy, please don't watch this episode. <laughs> it's not good. I literally can't goddamn hit him. I've got too much damage. Okay, I can I can attack, but it's it's weird. Doesn't work the way it should. Who knows what's going on now? 120,000 baby. Oh god, no. Ain't no way I'm faffing around with that crap. Those enemies are so annoying.
I think kidney stone is what's causing the main brunt of the issues, to be honest. Also, I don't know why my speed keeps changing so drastically. It's very annoying. Yeah, like, when it's doing this red flash, it means that kidney stone's ready, I think. Hello, Plum. You've been enveloped by a, a red destruction orb of death. Okay. Good, good. Gotta do the whole pumpkin thing over and over and over again. Bosh Why is Bosh Rush still there? Atten does I didn't realise that reruns... Yeah, I suppose you don't get achievements on reruns anyways, but I didn't realise it'd pop up with Bosh Rush. hey -ho. Down we go. Which way are we going? This way. Good. Yeah, do not want to deal with you guys. I'd love my flight back, please. I thought I had empty vessel, but I'm guessing I lost that in the rerun. Pretty funny. <laughs> of all the items to lose, of all the items I've got. Yeah, there you go. That actually killed him this time. Right. I don't know how many reruns we've got to do to unlock the gulp pill. Is it just the one or is it three? Because three's going to be a bit tedious, but not hard. Like, I might as well do it while I'm here sort of thing. It's just going to be a bit of a bit of a longie is all. There you go. We're up to 350 base damage. And I'm guessing we're in, in like 300,000s now in terms of 500,000. Nice. It, it is multiplicative though, so like, really? No, thank you. The more damage we get, the more damage we get each each time it does it. So it's, why, it's kind of why I wanted to do this, because it's just, I lost my ability to walk through doors. If I get hit, I can't walk through doors anymore. It's kind of upsetting. And I've got to give you all epilepsy for a little bit. There's another one of you? Why? Oh, wait, what? Okay, they, apparently they count as enemies that I have to kill to exit the room. I wouldn't have thought that. <laughs> it gives me a 1,800 damage to use one of those. My knockback is so severe. Flash of red and he's gone. Apparently it killed something there. Oh god, no, the lag. Just get in the chest quick. Every time that little ghost dies, he just triggers the laggiest experience of our lives. Not what I want. Pop the sun card for me. There you go. Speeds things up a little bit for us. Cheese and shortcut through these. And we're almost at a million damage now, baby. Yes, I think. A new pillar's appeared, okay. We've done one of them. I think it's three of them we've got to do. My hope is... Use this plus the speed to like... Basically just do the boss every floor. As long as we don't get hit, it works pretty well. We get the sun card every third room. Yeah, and we can just run straight to the boss. And we... In the meantime, we get to just see how crazy our damage can get. 0 0.92 extra damage, but the speed is really why we took that.
Right, keep it moving. Our speed is lovely right now, full on two speed. 368,000. We've, we do have a third Broken Heart now, so there is a small chance we get Broken Hearts. I think it's every time we go down to the next floor. Um, we're going to just go whatever way and then the, the card will correct our pathing. Yeah. Just don't get hit as we do it. Otherwise, everything's going to take a lot longer. I like that the Sun card does kill a room every now and again, though. That's nice. Yeah, 600,000 damage, you're not doing much against me, good sir. Each one of these gets quicker and quicker. We're just speeding through. But anyways, yeah, while I'm while we're here, if you guys are still watching all this madness, how's your day been? What's 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 going on with you? Like, what what's what's the Karen? Give me give me the lowdown, give me the news. Why not? Have a little nice little chat. Today it's been a very, very easy day. Um just went shopping in the morning. Uh, the new open beta for the new Call of Duty comes out later today, so I'm probably gonna play that for the rest of the evening. Chill out, I've got myself a, a little curry to have for tea. Pretty happy. Pretty happy. It's all good stuff. No, don't. Why? Where, where did where did this telepills bullshit come from? Who told you to do that? Now, come on now. Give it a rest. I mean, we are at 100,000 damage now. Is that 100,000 or is that a million? I'm pretty sure it's 100,000. Right, good. Don't know where those pills came from, but don't do that again, please. I do not respect that. Oh god. Don't get hit, don't get hit, don't get hit. Card clears the way for us a little bit there. Okay. I love the way it pushes them into the corner like that. Why not? Point 0.4 extra damage. I think we do need it, to be honest. I think it'll be helpful. Please say I'm going the right way here. Yes, I am. Good. Two... I need to actually count out how much damage I've got here. Two, six, three... That's 263,000. I think that's 2.6 million, you know. I'm pretty sure it is. The whole screen goes red. Nice. Gotta kill every door for some reason. Grab a nugget, another negative. Why'd I go in here? Bit of lump of coal, why not? Right. Down we go. I think I think the next one will spawn as the lost, won't we? Good. I am going the right way, lovely. Don't like that my little ghost keeps speeding ahead of me. I did not like that room either, that looks kinda horrible. Beautiful stuff. I didn't even look at the boss. So for some reason, every now and again, I, spot, I, I, I use like three pills at the end of a boss fight. Not every time, but sometimes. Not ideal. What time are we on? We're on 2 minutes 48 for this run, so the runs are clearly getting faster here. Saving us a lot of time here doing this. That's why we like deleted. This is why we like the deleted runs, people. What would be better now is if we find an Emperor card <laughs> every floor, but I don't think we're going to get one every floor. Oh, dude. We've, we've, um, we've, reached, we've reached the amount of damage that's like so insane that it can't calculate it correctly. And it's just like letters in there. There's letters in there. It literally lags the game every time I fire as it tries to calculate what damage I have. We do have another broken heart now as well. 
It likes the game pretty heavily every time I fire. I did get hit, so I'm having to kill all the rooms right now. Yeah, this is... I can't kill these guys at the minute. It's just like a lag flash, then death. Oh god. Lots of lag. Ooh, the pentagram in the background, though. Look at that. Is it gonna unlag at any point? Who knows? Okay, it did eventually. Okay. We're good, we're good. Right. Don't get hit next time. God damn, getting hit is so detrimental to us. It just makes everything take so much longer. Just sun card me, please. There you go. I don't know if I'm going the right way or not. You lost a lot of speed again. Just so confused about why my speed keeps going. Sometimes I have it, sometimes I don't. Oh god. Gotta stand up here so not get hit. <laughs> like it's This is this is truly, truly a deleted run. Nice. One more rerun. Yes, please. We're going to look butter on the last one. We are the lost now. We do have Holy Mantle, which I think is actually going to make things significantly easier for us. And we also have Flight now as well. I, I think this is overall better. Now, what I don't like is the fact that whenever we... Um, whenever we fire, we, we, do, we do kind of shit on the game a little bit. It doesn't it doesn't like it so much. Right. <laughs> Let's try and beat this last one. Sun card. Please, sun card. What we really want to do is we want to try and avoid firing wherever we can. <laughs> What the hell happened then? I don't even know what's going on right now. But we, we don't want to be firing. The game does not like it. Calculating this much damage was never, ever intended by the game. Every time I fire, it lags for like a solid five, six seconds. There's only currently like two or three instances in which we have to fire though, so... It shouldn't be too bad. That, that just gave us nothing. It was like, here's three capsules. No. Why didn't they just sun card at the start of every floor? That'd be making things so much easier. Thank God. Thank God we got this thing to be able to run through doors. Like, if we didn't have this, times would be tough. Because we'd have to be beat through all these rooms and not not going to work for us. It's just not. This is only with 500 damage and it still doesn't like it. Do you know what we need? Give me some toxic shock in this bitch. <laughs> Just insta-kill everything, every room. I fired. I don't know if it's going to catch up. I, I feel like our game's definitely going to crash before long. Why, why'd you gotta leave a little enemy like that? Do you know what's annoying as well? I don't have any like other ways to deal damage apart from my tears. It'd be so much better if we just had like something else to deal damage with. Because like even the roots that I'm getting here, I can't like use. That just did nothing as well. So a lot of items don't do anything for us anymore.
Oh, dude, come on. Just give me this goddamn sun card. Why is it lacking so much with even 500 damage? This is not sustainable. I need more ways to deal damage, game. Something to do with this little ghosty boy. Is that why it's lagging so much? It literally is. That little ghosty boy. We're going to have to kill him at the start of every floor, I think. He seems to be causing the lag. Okay, no. It still lags on the other room. <sighs> ah, boss kills are going to be rough from now on, I think. Boss kills are basically going to crash our game. If we've got the million damage, that is. If we've got the 500 damage, we should be fine. They do die eventually. Not a fan of them living, though, like this. <laughs> this is just stupid. It's the most damage anyone has ever had in an Isaac run. <laughs> I think I need to remove the defibs, but I have so many that I don't know if I can. Because this is just taking way too long, right? <laughs> I thought it was going to be nice and speedy, but every time I shoot... I don't even have like enough bombs to like kill normally elsewhere. Spawn a familiar that cycles between four forms. Okay, yes, please. Because I need something that deals damage other than me. Okay, I keep forgetting. Picking up items doesn't do anything anymore. <laughs> I keep trying to get different items, but they just, I just pick them up and nothing happens. There you go, that's a sun card. Yeah, I don't really know what to do here. I've got to hope that I don't get the high damage for bosses, I guess. Right. It's... it's... it's going. Got them sun card. Why don't you pro? What you always have to proc like at the latest possible time. Proc on the first room I go in, please. There you go. He's gone. Little ghosty boy is gone. Damn it! I think we've got big damage for the boss here. Not there's anything we can do against it. This is fine, but next room, we're kind of screwed. Okay, that works. The, the, the ghost thing works, so we can maybe use that here and there. Here and there, we can maybe use that. Right, <laughs> down we go again. We're almost done, people. We're almost done. Hey, we got the sun card straight away this time, finally. Bugger off you. Right, if there's no rocks in the room though, we've got a real hard time ahead of us. So yet again, we're on the crazy- Ah, oh, there's no rocks. God damn it. I'm gonna have to just debug kill this. Um, just to avoid 
absolute destruction of this game. I think I'm going to have to do that from now on. I realize it's technically cheating, but like the run is this. It's already, we're already cheating via deleted anyway, so whatever. Right, speed on through. Like, we're going to kill it is what I'm saying, like with the, the, the damage that we have. It's just going to take 15 years if I do it without console commands. I don't seem to have kidney stone anymore either. Right, this is another debug one. No, it... apparently I fired. Did not mean to. This could be a very long pause slash a crash. I thought I paused, but. <sighs> Let's just hold off, have a drink, chill out for a short time, see you wagwan. Uh. Come on Isaac, you can do it, you can just calculate what is looking to be about 6 billion damage. Quintillion or wherever you're at now. It's it's gears are turning. It's mulling it over. It's deciding if it wants to fire. We'll know soon enough. <laughs> I do wonder, like, what is going on behind the scenes to make it lag like this? Like, what's actually sort of the, the way that the game processes damage in order to make this so intensive? Because you wouldn't think it'd do this, right? There should just be like a hard cap on damage. I know that obviously you don't want to cap damage, but like, I feel like capping damage at like 5,000 is reasonable enough. <laughs> but anyways, looks like we're kind of stuck here for now. What I could do is I could force crash the game and then replay this floor if, it, if it's going to take too long. So at this point... It looks like it might be taking more time than it has in the past by quite a considerable margin. Especially because we've been through a few floors since we last fired. Like, we've our damage has climbed exponentially since then. Come on, nah. Yeah, okay, let's, let's try force crashing it and we'll replay the floor. If we can. It might not let us. We'll see. Right. Come on, game. I pray to you, I pray to the gods of this game to keep that run alive, somehow. So far, the game is just deciding not to boot back up, so... Not a... Not a particularly good sign of things to come. Literally, the game is just a black screen right now. I, I'm seeing exactly what you guys are seeing. So... Okay, oh, 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 we got something. We can continue. Weird to see the time. 3.47. Woom. Right, okay. We're back in it. Let's, let's, let's enable debug before we enter the boss fight this time, shall we? Right. There you go. Down we go once more. I'm not sure if we have to click yes or no on the next victory laps. I'm going to click yes just in case. Can I just trigger the... the... Okay, no. I was, I was wondering if I could just trigger the, the card by doing that back and forth. Um. Wait, wait, wait. Has it removed my sun card ability from me? Okay, I feel like restarting the game has uh, broken some functionality that we had before. I feel like there's some things that aren't working as they were. This is not what I wanted, game.
Oh, I fired. Why did I fire? I didn't mean to. <laughs> it crashed again. <clears throat> I didn't mean to shoot. We've, we've got no thingy card now, and I didn't want to go to the goddamn devil deal. Don't lock me in a room, that's just upsetting. Right, we're restarting again. Black screen for a short amount of time. <laughs> oh boy, this has been a a real funky wonky little uh little run this has. Okay, we're back again. <clears throat> At least we're on shoal this time. Or shield as it's meant to be pronounced apparently. Don't touch the goddamn chests this time. Wait! Okay, that dark out open because it's a mini boss, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Right, just keep going. Okay, boss time. And we do have big damage coming up. So, oh, we died there. Got a debug 10 here real quick. Boom. Through here we go. Yeah, we've completely broken this game. Don't know where my sun cards went though, that's so upsetting. I liked those for finding out where I was going, they were very useful. Seems like we're going the right way here though. Uh, I guess not. Spoke too soon, I guess. Oh, come on now, this is getting a bit ridiculous. Okay, this has got to be the right way. Yes, there you go. Okay. Kill little, little dude. And we can actually fire at him. Oh, dude. That's just unfair. That's just unfair. Okay, so what happened there is that I fired. Fine. It pushed me into the room behind me where my damage increased and therefore lagged the game and closed it. Rude game. Rude. <laughs> now I've got to remember that pathing again, which I think I remember, but I'm not entirely sure. Four minutes 29 at dark room. Right, I think it was left or... Oh, right, right, nope, oh, oh, right, 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 we are here, we, we do be debugging because otherwise nothing happens, yes, rerun, there you go, it's done. It is over. There you go. I hope you guys enjoyed this fucking crazy run, and I'll see you guys in the next one.